Locate the key box on the right hand side of the trailer. Make sure you read your emails carefully for all your pickup information and hire process. Enter your unique pin lock code into the touchpad and then press unlock after entering the code. You will find your keys inside. Use the keys to unlock the toolbox. You will find your shackles, wiring harness and any other accessories inside the toolbox. Use the keys to remove the coupling lock. Make sure the handle on the coupling is pulled up so it can be removed. Place the coupling lock back in the toolbox for transit and lock the toolbox. Return the keys to the key box. You'll see a green light flash and you'll hear a chime when the key box has locked itself. Raise the trailer with the jockey wheel until it clears the tow ball of your vehicle. Reverse the vehicle carefully and take your time. Never pull the trailer towards the vehicle, only reverse up to the trailer. Lower the trailer until the coupling has completely seated all the way and all the weight is taken off the jockey wheel. Then move the handle into the downward position, fit the linch pin to lock it in place and lift the reverse lockout latch for operation of trailer brakes and release the handbrake. Stow the jockey wheel in a horizontal position ensuring the jockey wheel handle is facing upwards. Fit your shackles and chains to the tow vehicle ensuring if there is two chains that they are crossed to create a cradle effect if the trailer detaches from the tow vehicle. Insert your wiring harness into the plug on the trailer Feed it through the coupling handle if it fits, and then to the plug on your vehicle. Check your lights are working. Check your right indicator, left indicator, brake lights, and tail lights. Do a full walk around inspection of the trailer, taking photos of every side, including the drawbar. Check wheel bearings for any play, inspect tire condition and report any damage or missing items and components on the trailer. Keep the photos of the trailer for seven days after your hire. Always drive safely and to the road conditions. If you're hiring one of our furniture trailers or one of our car trailers, it may be fitted with electric brakes. If you see a red sticker that says this trailer is fitted with electric brakes, that is the indication that you'll need to download the ELEC brake app to operate the brakes. Alternatively, if you have a brake controller fitted to your car, you can resume to use that as normal. You must always turn the headlights on to operate the brakes on any of our brake trailers. There'll be a quick guide in your emails on how to operate the electric brakes on our trailers and links to the app to download for either Apple or Android. Once you've finished with our trailer, you can return it to any of the park bays in our depot. Once it's parked, lock it up in the reverse order that you obtain the trailer. Turn the wiring harness, the shackles, into the toolbox. Fit the coupling lock to the coupling and return the main set of keys to the key box on the right hand side of the trailer. Do a full inspection of the trailer to ensure no damage was acquired during your hire. If so, report it to us so we can get on top of it straight away. Take photos of the trailer in its return position and send it in a text message to our mobile number. That will confirm that the trailer has been returned for your hire. And it's that easy. Your hire is complete and thanks for using us. Manta Ray Trailer Hire Mackay, simply click and collect.